want you to imagine a world without breast cancer. That is our goal. The fear associated with in women who think they will get breast cancer is so high and cannot be underestimated. We would like to devise technology that can accurately assess a woman's breast cancer risk every five years. So we can identify those at high risk and promptly reduce their risk. We can also identify those at low risk and minimize scans and treatment that can cause its own toxicity. Right now, we give more general advice, and I think that advice is important. But we want to take this one step further, and this requires two things. One, identifying new novel risk factors, as well as identifying techniques that we can use to monitor women over time that accurately can tell us their breast cancer risk during their lifetime. We are able to extract incredible amounts of information from their DNA that can tell us about their inherent risk, that can tell us about what they've been exposed to, and can hopefully tell us about their subsequent risk of developing breast cancer. Why this is such an exciting time is that we not only have the ideas, we have the tools to actually implement these ideas. And that is a key difference to 10 years ago. Our understanding of breast cancer itself has increased enormously in the last few years through abilities to actually sample tumor tissue, understand the changes that occur at a cellular level. So we need to now take that information and apply it to the preventive setting. So there's still a lot to do, but it is promising that we have come this far.